uh, just been looking at your odd socks there. What's going on? Yeah, it's just a superstition. Um, I, I always, I always race in odd socks, so it's just natural. My mum back home has like a basket of um, of just socks. She can't be able to, to pile them up because there's too many of us. So we just kind of, we just take them. Me and my brothers, and it's just became superstitious now. So <laughs> that's just that's how it is. Yeah. Okay, talking about the actual race, really, really strong finish from you there. Couldn't quite catch the German, but overall, how pleased are you with your effort? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's my fastest indoor opener, so I'll take that um, as a big positive. I wanted to front run it, but I just felt a bit rusty the first the first 50. Um, so it's got a bit slow off the mark, but, you know, it's not too bad. I was closing them down, and next time I'll, I'll get them anyway. How's the indoor or winter preparation for you go, been going overall for you anyway? Yeah, it's, it's been going, going brilliant. The past few months in Loughborough have been really, really strong. I'm running a lot more fluently. I've just been in Tenerife for the past, the past two weeks, so this isn't a sunbed. And uh, yeah, everything's going very, very well. So, you know, I've finished university and stuff, and, and this is my job now, so I can focus a lot more and, and uh, you know, get, get bringing these times down and get myself to some more major championships anyway. Uh, how are you coping with the weather in Loughborough now compared to Tenerife? <laughs> I just got back a few days ago, so I've not actually been back down. However, when I stepped off the plane in Edinburgh the other day, it was absolutely freezing. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll experience it this week now that I'm, I'm back home properly. But it's just one of those things, we'll have to crack on with it. You're the Scottish ace. Uh, how difficult is it racing in that bib, knowing how much kind of rests on your shoulders to hopefully get as many points as possible? Yeah, I mean, I was, I was really, really hoping to win, especially like at, at here last year. Um, people are expecting me to win, I'm, myself included. Um, so I'll just take this, take this added pressure. It's just one of those things I'll have to start dealing with now in the future. What's the next few steps for you going into the rest of the indoor season? Um, I'll race in Bishkov in Poland on the 3rd of February. So I'll get myself ready for that and hopefully I can get a nice, a nice quick one. There's some top European runners running there. So I'll get in the back, get started off a bit quicker and uh, hopefully get a nice clean race. And then, you know, move forward for the next chance. And then uh, European Championships. <laughs> That's the big one. That's the big one for the indoor season. Good luck with that. Thank you so much. Brilliant. Cheers.